Mr Clark, do you accept that VAT has been knowingly involved in smuggling tobacco products into Vietnam? No, I think that is quite untrue, but I'm waiting to see what the results will be of the government, British government's DTI inquiry, which is now taking place into all these wild allegations that have been made in recent years. Well, now, have you received that? From uh, Ian Hacking. Yes, I think I have. Right. Now, do you acknowledge that this memorandum is telling you that VAT has been brilliantly successful in managing smuggling operations around the world? For decades. Well, I don't believe it's accurate, although that's the allegation the letter makes, but that's the kind of thing that the DTI is now looking into. You're deputy Chairman of the company, don't you want to know for yourself why you're, why you're waiting for a bunch of public servants? <laughs> I'm waiting for independent inquiries rather than rather fanatic campaigners who make these allegations without producing evidence in support of them. And we are certainly, as a company, we have a firm policy of not having anything to do with smuggling, and that we will continue with. This man is no fanatical campaigner. He's a former senior member of BAT. He's used by fanatical campaigners and they, they, no doubt it's now being seen that people are now trying to discover whether this ex-employee is able to provide any evidence uh, to support his allegations. Are you telling us he's lied here? I'm telling you, it's got, it should be properly investigated and I'm not going to agree with him simply because you pressed me vehemently on the streets of Newcastle. You're paid tens of thousands of pounds a year to hold high office in BAT. Isn't it your role and responsibility to know the truth? Uh, precisely, it Don't is. Don't you want to satisfy yourself you're not being paid with money derived from criminal activity? I, I certainly don't want to get any money from criminal activity. The company does not condone, organise or take any part in criminal activity. Right, what, the, right. the, the, the idea that one piece of paper should in itself make me not wait for a Department of Trade inquiry seems to me rather preposterous. You're, I'm, in, you're in the position of being a senior political figure in this country and not knowing whether or not you're being paid with criminal money. I know that the company's policy is to have nothing to do with smuggling, not to condone smuggling. We instruct our employees to have nothing to do with smuggling and I know that so far no one has produced any evidence at all to substantiate any of these allegations. All right, let's go. <laughs> Wonderful.